Rev Cook once wrote that God left the world unfinished so that we could partner with him to complete creation. God was the first glass blower. He blew the source of life into Adam. For me, my art, this is the Sfurim that I produce. Being inspired, feel a connection, feel a connection to Hashem. The elegant simplicity of the ingredients, that is very spiritual. It's a canvas and paint, and then you turn it and transcend it into something more, and that power of potential, it's so spiritual. I'm in partnership with my creator by allowing the force of creation to flow through me. I often feel a flow of energy coursing through me. It doesn't come from me, it comes from somewhere beyond me. Well, some people would sing their messages and their emotions. Some people would play it. In my language, is art. The creativity when it's oriented towards Torah, when it has a, a connection to its true source, that's the creation flowing from God through us to us. I see my hand. But there is somebody on my shoulder that tells my body what to do, and that is Hashem. Me and Hashem, we are companion. What I create with my cello is also intangible. It exists, but now that I'm done playing, did it happen, did it not? Is it here or is it not? So it allows me to bridge that gap between being a physical being and also being a spiritual being. The body comes from my heart. It's all mineral is in the earth, is in the body and the same mineral I use for glass. The shape of the human being look like a god. The exact words is the Ruach Elohim. I really try to seek him out and look for him and incorporate God into my work. When I paint, I really want to inspire also. God was really in my fingertips. When I first encountered him, I met God the artist. It was in a tropical rainforest that I saw a tree that was so exquisite I was sure it had been painted on. People think Orthodox Jews are black and white, but really we are so colorful. I believe that music is one of the only portals that we have left to our creator. Art is a form of service of God because he created the world with so much beauty and depth, and he expects us to use it to elevate ourselves and the people around us to inspire and to build. An art piece, a new project, I feel it coming from above, and then a whole story emerges. The art calls us. It beckons us. It's up to you to finish it. <laughs>